Hey everybody, um, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, probably like the third last parish or something. So, um, let's go. Oh, I remember this place. Actually, there are two places like this, so maybe I'm just thinking of the other one. Because I haven't actually, like the last time I did this last part of the game was probably like a year ago. I think it was actually. Well, anyway, we're going to meet a familiar face here, as far as I remember. Well, first, aren't we going to do, um... Yeah, first there's this. This is very important. It's very important! According to the Red Queen, at least. <laughs> Let's go in here first. I think this is the one you go into. And it shows you, like... Right. Top right. Bottom left. Bottom right. Top left. <laughs> so basically like an X. Liam Neeson's gonna tell us something. Harry, you must remember well the appearance of this room. The shape of the floor, the number... Oh, come on. Though I suppose, like, I, I was going to say, does he think I'm an idiot? But I actually, like, in, um... In this room, like, the last time... <laughs> Well, no, not in this room. Do you know in that room in the forest temple in um, Twilight Princess, where you're? Sp I think it's to get the bosky. You have to use the Gale boomerang and like hit like um, the pillars in the right order, order or something. And like I did it. Re <laughs> I was like, "What are we supposed to do? You have to hit them in the." Right and I didn't like see like that there was like a symbol on the background telling you which order to like hit them in. I honestly didn't, and I was there for eight. It took me ages, so like. Maybe they, maybe they do have to like tell us what to do. Cause yeah, uh, unless you hadn't guessed, you're supposed to hit those switches in the order they show you, and it makes this like dark void. It's like the thing in Super Paper Mario, that game I hate. Um, that basically, well, he might. Oh my God, look at his eyes. Yeah, no wonder he's scared, John. I see. So this is the portal through which Ganon was able to seep into the unsuspecting world above. Harry, we shall make use of this patch that Ganon created for himself. If there is anything from the world above that you believe you need, then climb into the boat and enter the Column of Darkness. Okay, I'll tell you now, basically what that place goes to is a ghost of Forsaken Fortress, unless you couldn't guess already. But yeah, that's where it goes, so if you want to like go back and do stuff before taking on the final part of the game, that's where you go, you go to um, the Forsaken Fortress. And now... I always like go to... What are we supposed to do here? Oh my god, how do we start this game again? I can't remember what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to, like, do something. Okay, hold on for a sec. What are we supposed to do? Please? Could you tell us? Maybe we're supposed to leave. I wonder what happens if you go through that, like, black door. Like, through this, like, opening back here. I wonder where you come out. That'd be kind of cool. Maybe you can go, like, down Zora's River on the King River. No, you can't. That would be cool, though. Imagine, like, going down and visiting King Zora using the King of Red Lion. That'd be pretty cool. I suppose I should really show where this goes, though. Seems like I can't figure out how to do the next part of the game. Yeah, it brings you here, like, right where you first um, landed in the Forsaken Fortress. So that's where you go if you ever want to, like, go back to... you think they would have put it somewhere where there was a warp point, though, I don't know. I always felt there should be a warp point at the Forsaken Fortress for some reason, but I guess there's not. Maybe you have to do that to trigger the next part of the game, I don't know. Let's just get out of here and see what we can figure out. I'm sorry this is, like, being all stupid and whatnot, but... That's the way Let's Plays go sometimes. It's some. It's to do with this. What am I supposed to do? Maybe you have to go into this room. I don't know. Is there something down here? <laughs> oh yes, this is what you have to do. Because look who will appear. Have to like 
You'll have to do your, um... Your tennis thing. Anyone for tennis? I kind of like... I really like this. I kind of... Oh, come on! Did you seriously hit me? Come on, let's try again. Come on, let's dance, motherfucker. Oh, come on! I know, it just reminds me of, like, when you get to the end of Ocarina of Time, and that's what, um... Oh, come on. That's where you're supposed to use the spin attack. I'm sorry, I'm really bad at this. Like that. And that'll, like, stun him for ages, so you can, like, go and, like, hit him. But you actually only hit him once, and he dies, and then you follow the handle of his sword to the next door. And basically, this is like a maze. And by beating, um, by following the right path and beating Phantom Ganon every time, it'll, like, lead you to the... True to the end of the end of the maze, or whatever. If you can stop getting hit like an idiot! Oh my god! Come on, Harry! Finally, jeez. Okay, so... Follow the handle, the handle of the sword, not the blade of the sword. You follow the handle of the sword. <laughs> this is so stupid. I can't believe I'm like screwing up because like I've been pretty good at this game so far, so I can't believe I'm like screwing up at this point of the game. Okay, here's spin attack, spin attack. There we go. Okay, see, it's not that hard, Harry. If you could stop like doing jump attacks towards him, maybe. <laughs> I can't believe I'm like, because I've been pretty good at this game so far, thank god, and I haven't really made a fool of myself that much, but like... Am I seriously going to start now? <laughs> Come on, this takes such a long time, it's so annoying. But I guess it's kind of cool, I love Ganon's Tower in this game, I just think it's so fun. They made it so like... You know, like, I just loved, like, they just made, it's just like a big, like, fun park. Well, I guess it's not like a fun park. <laughs> I don't know. But it is, it's kind of like a fun park. You know, you get to fight Phantom Ganon again, you get to fight all the bosses again. You get to, like, um, well, you'll see what we get to do. You get to, like, take, find a shortcut to the Forsaken Fortress. This should be one, we should be nearly done with now. Oh, I forgot you can do, like, a parry attack there. That's what you're supposed to do, as far as I know, when he, like, does that, um... circle thing. But yeah, it always reminds me of, like, fighting Ganondorf in Ocarina of Time, because, you know, there's, like, the big one that you have to use the spin attack on, and there's, like, the normal one that you have to f hit back at him, whatever. Oh, I think this is where we have to fight him for real. Okay, come on, come on, come on, you big dummy. Come on, Link, come on, Link. Link, 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 Link. Yeah, we have... Oh, no. Really? We can't do anything. Oh, here we go. I made a mistake when I said we got all of our equipment, because this is actually the last piece of the equipment of equipment in the game. Wait till you see what it is. You guys are going to love this. The light arrows. And look how dangerous they look. They look really painful. The sacred light of these arrows can pierce pure evil itself. Now basically... Well, change the light arrows. These things will mess any enemy in the game. Even Dark Nuts with their armor on will get killed in one hit from these things. And I'll demonstrate that in a minute. But... Wait till you see how, like, what these things do. Just, it's crazy. We're gonna have to do like a final showdown with Shin here, but one light arrow, and I love this. Just look at that. We'll kill him. It's just, it's like when you use like the plasma beam on on enemies, and or like, and they just like completely like disappear. It's amazing. Now, but what you have to do now is you have to. I'm going to like stand on this like this thing to do because I'm going to make it all like amazing, like something of, like a f cutscene of like Final Fantasy VI or something. Boom! <laughs> Could you imagine if it had, like hadn't hit it and just had, like fallen short? That would have been the most depressing thing ever. <laughs> so yeah, um, I think this is our last chance to save. So I'm going to save right now. I think I better save right now before I fall any deeper. Would you like to continue playing? Hell yes! And in the next part, 
we're going to take on the next section of Ganon's Tower. What's this going to be, like the fourth video in Ganon's Tower? Um, well, anyway, it's a really fun one, so I'll see you then.